morning boys and girls. This is Thursday. I'm preparing the video for you so that you know what it's going to be like to come back to school on Wednesday, Thursday and then everybody back on Friday. We're really looking forward to seeing you but I'm going to ask really carefully don't come before your time. Make sure you spread out and then there will be lots of adults here to help you get into school safely for the school starting. I look forward to seeing you. Bye bye. This is where you need to say goodbye to mum, dad or whoever's dropping you off. Give them a big kiss and a hug and a wave and there'll be lots of staff waiting to take you into school and show you where to go. Adults dropping off, use all the space on the grass at the bleaching field to maintain your two metres spacing and please don't arrive before your allocated time. If you come to school on a scooter or a bike, we can help you put that in the rack if you need it. For our new primary ones, we're going to bring you into the main entrance of the school, where the office and the library is. You've probably visited here while you were at nursery. Perhaps you came up to the office, perhaps you came up to the library with your nursery class. This is the way you'll come in and we'll be there to show you where it is. You'll see some tape on the floor that looks a little bit like this. That's just to help the adults in the school remember to keep two metres distance. We'll show you along the corridor all the way to your classroom. Here's one of the primary one classrooms. I think this is Mrs Moore and Mrs Valente's classroom. Looks a bit empty at the moment. That's because there's no children in it. But when you arrive, you'll meet your friends and your classroom will look very much like this as well. You'll be shown where your desk is and where your chair is and where to put your things. And your teacher will be there to help you with any questions that you might have. You'll get a tray that looks something like this with your name on it. In that tray, the teacher will have put pencils and pens and everything you need to do your writing and to do your activities. So you don't need to bring any of those with you. Just bring in yourself, a jacket, a named water bottle, which has been filled up at home, and your packed lunch if you're bringing one. Primary twos, this is a wee bit of film to show you how to walk round to your entrance. Go past the play pod and round the corner and walk down the side of the building to the door at the end. Again, don't worry, lots of members of staff will be there to show you the way. Primary threes, you'll go in through the red doors. These are the doors that you might have used to go into the toilets at break time. But don't worry, we'll show you the way. The primary three classrooms will look a little bit different this year. You'll see that the desks will be in rows like this and you'll all be facing the front. It's a little bit different to normal, but we're sure you'll get used to it. Break times are going to be a little bit different this year because we want you to play with just the children in your class. So at break time, your teacher will take you out to a zone in the playground. We've got 10 different zones and in each zone will be a different activity. Maybe drawing with chalks, maybe an obstacle course, maybe a game with balls. You'll be asked to stay in that zone for your break time or your lunch time and play just with your class. So I know that's a little bit different and it might be quite hard to do but we really want you to try your best so that we can keep everybody in their class bubbles and keep them nice and safe. We know that you'll be really good at doing that and we hope that you enjoy all the different activities that we will have organised and set out for you in the playground. Lunches will be a little bit different too. You'll eat your lunch in your classroom with your class and your teacher. It will be a packed lunch that you've brought in or a packed lunch that the school will provide.
Hand washing is so important at the moment. Your teacher will be asking you to wash your hands when you get to school and before you go out to break and when you come back in, before you eat your lunch and, be and afterwards. And of course, after you've been to the toilet. Make sure you wash them properly with soap and water and especially dry them well after to stop them from getting sore. But the biggest message we want to give today is how pleased we are to welcome you all back to school. We'll look after you, we'll make you feel safe and welcome and we'll make sure that you have a fantastic time. So please try not to worry. We'll be there to help you every step of the way. So that just leaves me to say we look forward to seeing you on either Wednesday or Thursday and Friday next week. Bye, see you then.